so what about this historical day uh, you were inside you attending the demonstration what's your opinion yeah look at i think it was really important to be here i mean the eyes of the world are on this case where would you get it that people on every continent are tuned into their computer screens they're watching it live on television i don't think we've ever had a case like that so the reason for that is clearly the horrors of the atrocities which have been carried out by the israeli state over the past more than three months now uh, so what we have is them finally on trial but also international law itself is on trial and uh, you know when you heard the huge content from the south africans utterly shocking utterly heartbreaking but so clearly meeting the terms of genocide in the context of the convention that it really leads us to the place that either the court will independently and legally adjudicate these matters in which case they can only find with south africa or they allow political interveners to undermine again the international system of international law and regulation and if that were to happen then the consequences for humanity and i think the consequences in terms of the outpouring of opposition on the streets will be the likes of which we have never seen so i think the court has to be cognizant of that also and will presumably take that into account